how's it going? So thank you for clicking in. First off, thank you so much. So that means that you're interested in this type of video, which is gonna be a full afternoon of venue hunting, um, looking at linen, tablecloths, playing around with place settings, how we want that to be, going to a florist. And I actually haven't been into this florist, but I do know that this florist is good for DIY brides. So they buy in bulk. So that'll be exciting to like look at. So I'm excited about today. Like the creative juices are gonna get to go in today. We're gonna kind of like make some decisions. And this wedding is in um, June of 2021. So we definitely have time, which is a good thing, but it's also good just to like narrow it down because this client, she has a busy schedule. She has a child, you know, just kind of just all over the place and busy like everyone else. So we definitely want to start making some decisions as early as we can. So I'm excited to see everything, especially the venue. I'm excited to go see because it's a new venue in Murfreesboro, Tennessee, and I need to see it in person. The website is not, not fully um, up yet and they are still renovating this property. They are like building lakes. So I'm excited to like see this in person with my own eyes and so this is gonna be a fun day. This is gonna be a fun day. Oh, and I also need to go to um, a few home goods, maybe a couple Rosses, and and see if they have any Halloween decor. So hopefully we have a good day and we win in the decor department.
back from all the stores. I got some good things. I'm just taking the bags upstairs. <laughs> this is where I, I like hide my bags. So I am in the guest room and this is where I store a lot of things. It's just a room to like close off the door. I do have a room that's like my studio, but right now it's just full of inventory and I can't get anything done. So um, guest room it is behind here. I just filmed, I just filmed um, a giveaway video, filmed that yesterday. So probably by the time you are watching this video, the giveaway video is already live. So make sure you are subscribed and that you are doing everything that qualifies you for the giveaway. Because like I said, given the items away, I want to pick two subscribers. Thank you so much again for getting me to 100 subscribers. So I have two subscribers who are going to win. And I'll leave the information down below in this video as well. Because it still should be open. So, ah. It just gets me excited just saying that. But I'm just gonna do a quick little haul. I actually went to a lot of stores, so I'm not gonna show you everything, just because I do have videos that are coming up that you'll see most of the things, but just wanna give you an idea. Like if you're just out looking for, um, start looking for your Halloween decor, and that way you can, um, and, that way you, and that way you can start shopping for it. So I just wanna give you a few ideas. Oh, also, I have Halloween outfits coming. So just by looking at it, can you guess? Can you guess what it what it's gonna be? If you can, leave a comment below what you think those outfits. Who am I gonna be for Halloween? So let's get into it. Oh, went to Joanne's, got some lace. Okay, so let me tell you a tip before I get started. Um, when I go shopping for anything, actually, clothes, home decor, anything, anything I'm looking for on Amazon online. If I cannot guess the price or if I'm looking at it, I'm like, okay, this is what I want to spend on it. No more than $20 and it's $24. I will not buy it. That's not me being cheap. I just know that it did not cost that much to make this item. So therefore I do not want to pay the extra $4 for the item unless I really, 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 really need it. But usually I don't. So um, that's what I do when I'm shopping for home decor or anything like that. If I look at it and say I look at it and I'm like, okay, that should be $16.99. And when I pick it up and it's $20.99, then it goes right back down. Because to me, why would I spend my money on something that I didn't even think was worth the $20? So that's my little tip and that's what I like to keep in mind. But this guy, it is, let me put it back together for you. <laughs> it's a skeleton cookie jar. And like, I have a good idea with this one. So when I saw this, I was like, okay, $20 for this, right? It was $12.99 at Marshall's. So this definitely went into the cart. $12.99, that was, to me, that was a steal because I thought it was $20. So in my head, I'm like, I won. <laughs> so that's just what I like to do. Y'all, we have a squatter in our house, and I swear, like, we're home! Like, get settled. Like, you live here for free. Like, don't be trying to scare me. Anyways, and I picked up this dish towel. Look at him. I like that. It's like yoga out. Yum. And it comes like with this gold one, but I really like like this one. And it was $6.99. Black and gold, you already know, that's my color. Black and gold is my color. Anything else I should show you right now? Oh, so I was on a hunt for velvet pumpkins and I scored. So I found little ones at TJ Maxx. Look how pretty that is. And these were $6.99, so I got two of those. And then I found the big one at Marshall's. And where's the tag? This one had like a tiny, tiny chip in it. And I didn't see it until I got to the counter. And I was getting ready to run back to get another one. And she was like, no, I'll just take 10% off. So that's cool. And I got it for $12. 10% is good to me. I'm like, no tax on it. Look how pretty that is. It's so me. I love it. 
So that is all I want to show you. Like I said, I want to say some things for the video, but I do want to like recap on what happened today as far as like wedding planning and all the above. And it was so much fun. Like today was fun and it makes me so excited because my client was really, really excited. Like her creative juices was flowing. Like she already had an idea of what she wanted and had her inspiration boards already going. So just to like get her touching the linen, playing around with different linen and like chargers and glassware and silverware and just seeing her vision come to life, it was a lot of fun because what she thought she wanted, it actually kind of changed. So it's always good to just get out there and just play around. And if you are not comfortable with going out into the world and going out to like do these visits, um, I understand, I get it. And an option for you to do is go into a wholesale linen website and just order one tablecloth from like each color that you like. So you, it'd be like $5 or $6. And I'll leave some websites down, full, down below for you. And just like order those and that way you can see the linen and like you can feel it, you can touch it, you can see what goes along with it. And then if you don't like it, you can send those ones back. Y'all in the flower market, like, I'm so glad we were able to squeeze in that appointment. That place is incredible. Like, ugh. So, how it works is, if you have any type of event, you can just go, go there and order flowers and you get them in bulk. For weddings, you will come like a few days before the wedding. So, if you have a Saturday wedding, come on Thursday. No, the earliest is probably Wednesday. And you, your mom, a few of your girls um, will will pay $30 and you will get the table to start setting up your arrangements. Now you can have a you can have a specialist help you for $95 an hour and they will show you how to put the arrangements together, what arrangements will look nice and full, um, what direction you're going into. And so you can use their examples and then start working on what they gave you to work with. Isn't that fun? So it's it's cutting the cost down completely and you're able to DIY you're able to be hands-on and it's a chance for you to start incorporating other people into your wedding planning and making them feel special too so I thought that was such a unique place I love it and and today was just fun it was fun to just get out and about and really start diving into her wedding and her wedding is um I think I mentioned it earlier, but her wedding is June in June of 2021, the day before my best friend's Ken's wedding. So I am trying to like make sure we like get everything like planned to the detail for her wedding because I have to like take a red eye to Boston probably during the reception. Hopefully not. Hopefully I can like really like catch a flight at 5 a.m. on uh, the day of Ken's wedding, but don't know, I can't see any flights yet. So it's too far out to see flights, but I am making sure that I'm doing my part, that my client is happy. I'm gonna have a great team in place. But I, like I said, for my peace of mind, I have to know that everything is like lined up all together and like a plan B is in action and motion as well. So I hope you enjoyed this type of video. So like this video for more behind the scenes and don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to enter the giveaway like i'm giving you away free items like go use it as a gift like if you're not a bride to be send it as a gift or save it for later <laughs> or if you just like free things hey it's for you but i appreciate the love and support that you have given me thank you so much y'all have a good night bye